Hey guys, it's Jen and welcome back to Sim Airport. So since last I played this game, there was another update. And I'm going to go over everything that they changed in a second. But first thing you should know is that old saves will not work with this update. So if I go and like open up the save from last episode, it will say that it's incompatible. So like I can't play that that um that file anymore, that save anymore. So I'm going to have to start a new one. But they did change a few things, which I guess makes it worth it. In my opinion, I like these new updates. So I'm going to go ahead and start another one. We are going to go with career mode and we're going to go with extra large and start from scratch. No. All right. Let's go ahead and start a new game. All right. So here we are on the new map. We have like a little train area thingy and a bunch of passenger bus people coming by here. Anyway. Um, so one of the things that they changed was larger runways. You can actually upgrade the runway. If I go upgrade, you can see you can actually change the size of the runway, which um, I'm not sure what that exactly does, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it lets you have more um, airplanes land and take off at the same time, so that way you don't have to worry about, uh, you know, airplanes getting backed up. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm glad that they added that. They also made it so you can actually um, research land expansion, which lets you buy more land. It's only north and east. You can only buy it in those directions, but still pretty cool. That means that you can make a really, really, really large airport, which I really want to do. How many times did I say really there? And the last thing I'm going to talk about is a standby gate. And pretty much what a standby gate... I'm going to go ahead and resume and do some stuff while I talk about this. So a standby gate is pretty much uh, a thing that if, if your airplanes or whatever, are they're backed up, then the passengers will go to a standby gate where they wait for the airplane that is currently in the gate to leave so that they can then go on the airplane themselves. And I believe the airplane goes into standby gate and then goes to the gate that they need to go to once that airplane leaves. It sounds confusing. I may have made it sound more confusing than, than it actually is. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. We have, to, we have to start from scratch again. So first thing is first. Hopefully we don't go broke again. We are going to make a little, little, little storage room. A little, little tiny storage room right there. There we go. That should be good enough. I'm also going to research pricing so I can actually change the price on things. All right, let's go ahead and research financing. Then I have to research this. Oh, gosh. All right, so I need to save at least... Nine thousand dollars. I can actually do that. Let's go ahead and speed this up. Also, while I'm here. I'm gonna change the drop-off zone. I'm gonna put it over here because nobody likes walking really far. I know I don't like walking really far. All right, right here. That's gonna be the drop-off zone right there. Actually, this entire area is gonna be a drop-off zone. There we go. And now we hire airplanes. Okay, so uh, we need one. How many can we get? I think it was two per like time slot, right? So we can get two in the morning, two in the afternoon, and two at night. I think. I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and just get two in the morning and see how that goes. All right, so I think we can have two per time slot. So let's go ahead and do that again. We're going to go ahead and go with two afternoons. There we go. Uh, status. Not status. Wrong one. Oh, gosh. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. And now we need two at night, which we can't do yet because we need to have uh, the airplane thingy, the runway thingy upgraded. So let's go ahead and upgrade that. Runway lights. Boop. There we go. All right. Now we're going to have... Airplanes come in at night. Let's just go ahead and hire two of them. That's afternoon. That is not nighttime. The sun is not out during the nighttime. Where? Why does no one want to be here at night? All right, forget it. All right, we don't want you here at night anyway. We also need to expand the security area again because there's never enough security. So let's go ahead and we're also going to... Oh, gosh, there's so much to do. I shouldn't have hired all those planes. Also, before I forget, food vending. If they want to grab a snack before they go on the plane, don't worry about it. We're all good. All right, research is done. Let's go ahead and get pricing. Pricing. Pr pr pricing. CFO. Oh, my God. All right, well, let's go ahead and hire a CFO. Uh, I forgot how to make a CFO. All right, so we're putting a CFO over here. So if anybody complains about ticketing, well, they can complain to the CFO. I'm not getting complaints thrown at me, all right? I'm a nice guy. Hire some more workmen. Okay, everything's going great. How are you guys doing? All right, now that that's done... We need to make it a nice little room because our CFO does not live in a dump, all right? He lives in a great place. We're going to make it a great place. There we go, like this, like that. That is not even in this bothering me. Well, too bad. <laughs> I'll fix it later. Let's go ahead and put down a door. Can't go into a room without a door. There we go. And door. Where's the office? Office. All right, office. There we go. Alright, so the office is all done. Well, wait, wait, it's not done. Office desk and office chair. Of course! Of course! We can't have an office without an office desk and office chair. There we go. Office chair. 
and office desk. Here we go. You better not complain. That desk cost me a lot of money. And CFO. You go in there. There you go. Have fun, little CFO. Now, I should be able to change the prices for this. If I can find... There it is. All right. Uh, nope. Now... Oh, wait. Now I can research pricing. There we go. Research that. So then I can change the price. And then we can start making a lot of money. A lot of money. We'll be rolling in money. Our airplanes will be made of money from how much money we'll be making. All right. So, we also need to expand the security area. I'm kind of glad that I restarted because what I did before was horrible. Like, that that was that was a horrible start. <laughs> we also need to put down some wall right here. And then the door. Do we have, like, did they add dual doors? Like, double doors? Double doors. Do we have two of them? Nope. No double doors. All right, we'll make our own double doors. Oh, I did not mean to do that. No, cancel. We'll make our own double doors. And storage shelves. Uh, storage zone. Dang it! Alright, storage. Ooh, never mind. Alright. I'm an idiot. Let's go ahead and remove that. And then we gotta go all the way over here. And we're storage. Storage. Boom! Done! Alright. So, now we can finally put storage shelves. That's not storage shelves. Storage shelves. In there. Like this. Oh, that is beautiful. This place is looking like a five-star airport. We have no chairs. All right, this is not a five-star airport. <laughs> Everyone's legs are going to start dying. Oh, no. All right, look. Don't worry. I'll save your legs. Just got to give me a second. Also, I've been thinking about making a series on Prison Architect. I'm not sure if you guys want to see that. I've been trying to learn how to play the game. It's a lot more complicated than I thought it would be. Um, because <laughs> you have to, like, you have to, like, grab electricians to put electrical wire underground and, like, water pipes and you... You have to connect everything to water pipes. It's way more complicated than I thought it would be. But anyway, if you guys do want to see it, I have been playing it. I've been having a lot of fun with it. So, um, if I do play immediately, I'm not going to know what to do. So, I might spend some time just uh, playing the campaign and finding out how to play it. So, I don't know. I don't know. Do you guys want me to play it, you know, blindly? Like, without finishing the campaign? Or do you guys want me to finish the campaign first? I don't know. You guys tell me if you, if you even want to see that. But uh, anyway, let's go ahead and add some more baggage scanners. So we can go to actually we haven't been having an issue with this right just just in case one more baggage scanner there we go two more baggage scanners now it's time to make this place look beautiful well first off before i do that yes it's not done yet all right never mind how much is done 73 percent we spent like five hours doing that not really it's been like five minutes but <sighs> all right well i guess we'll just stick with making the place look oh, that's the wrong button we'll stick to making this place look beautiful so let's add some benches we'll do it like this I always do it like sh like straight like this. I want to do it like this now. So let's go ahead and do it like that. And boop. I really wish they did have TVs in this. I'm not sure if people can actually fit through there if I put like only one slide in between. But whatever. They'll find a way. We also need some kiosks, which I'm going to put over here. Kiosk, 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 kiosk. Everybody gets a kiosk. And then we are also going to need... What, do we, what else do we need? ATMs. That's what, I was <laughs> That's what I was doing before and then I forgot about... The kiosk, and now I forgot about ATMs. Alright, so. I'm gonna put one ATM over there in the corner. What's going on here? Hello? Yes, hi. Why is, why are there, why is there nobody working there? Hello? Uh, one, two, three. There we go. That should be fine now, right? Hopefully. Why was no one working there? Gosh. We also need another metal detector. Oh, no. I messed up. I messed up. It was all going so well, and I, I decided, you know what? I wanna be, I wanna be a, a, a nice person, and everything just messed up. One there, one one there. All right, that should be enough, right? That hopefully is enough. If it's not enough, then I'm gonna cry myself to sleep. Also, gotta put some garbage bins over here and over here. Put some right outside the bathroom so people can stop being disgusting and throwing their garbage on. God, I, it, there we go. They can stop being disgusting and throwing their garbage on the floor. All right, now it's time. We can finally increase. Oh, what's that? We can't increase the price yet. All right, so if we put a thousand dollars and we charge forty dollars per wait, let's go. Let's go slowly with this. Slowly with this. Uh, this is that four hundred, right? Let's change this to six hundred. Let's put it right above it. So eight hundred dollars and forty dollars per passenger. All right, that's good. All right, that's fine. I, we pretty much we more than doubled our money. So, all right. Not bad. We can also start some research again. What does this do? A CEO, Chief Operations Officer. Hmm. Do we need that? I don't think we need that yet. We're not gonna get that yet. 
Just in case, let's, let's go ahead and do it. Also, before I forget, we what is this? Baggage Hub Specialty 6-2. What? Is this also new? <laughs> oh no! Baggage Hub? Sorts and routes incoming baggage downstream to other endpoints, including other hubs for ports. What? Is this like... Is this computer? Are they like USBs? What is this? Sorts and routes... Oh no... Eight ports, eight ports, what does this mean? Specialty? Oh, oh no. I'ma I'm a hope this works, because if it doesn't work, I'ma be a little, a little sad. All right, there we go. Nope, can't do that. All right, do that. Nope, still can't do that. All right, well, what this? Am I doing this backwards? Should this be connected to this and then the other way around? Because that's like, that's like an outward arrow, right? So it should be like this, I think. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I haven't... Oh gosh, why do I keep forgetting things when I play this game? We have to assign the baggage depot to aircraft gates now. Oh gosh. Everything got a lot more complicated in this last patch, huh? I don't, I don't think I'm ready for this. I don't think... I don't think my brain is ready for all this. Never mind, I think I was right before. I'm so stupid. I don't know what I'm doing. Can't... Oh, it says cannot connect to, to more than two objects. Is that what the depot's for? This thingy, the hub? The baggage hub? Oh, okay. So I have to place one of these down, I guess. Hmm? Do I? I don't get it. Well, we're about to find out how I do this. We're gonna place that right there. And then we're gonna grab this. And we're gonna move it like this. Can I do it like this? Nope. So I have to like do it individually. I have no no idea what I'm doing, but it looks right. I'm a, I'm gonna stick with it. I'm gonna stick with this and hope. I'm gonna hope. All I need in life is hope. I don't get it. What am I doing wrong? What what changed? So I read the patch notes again just to find out exactly what I'm doing wrong. And what I'm reading here is that you cannot actually put the conveyor belts in one segment, if that makes sense. I, I can't connect these two and put them... I, I have no idea how to explain it, but pretty much I can't connect two to one. All right? I can't have multiple leading to the same one. I have to do each one individually, but I'm not sure how that works with this. Like, how do I make this work? I have to connect the same colors to the same colors. So this is green right now. It was pink, but I have to connect pink to pink and blue to blue. So how do I do this? What is this blue one for then? We're gonna spend this entire episode doing this, just saying, guys, because I have, I have no idea how this works now. So wait, wait, wait a second, wait a second. So I can't, if I do it like this then, because I'm gonna remove this one, and I do this, after that one gets destroyed by li literally anybody, someone's like, alright, there we go. If I do that, so I have to have, that's kind of annoying. Like, I can only use one baggage thingy, one, one of this, one baggage depot per, um, hub port. That's kind of annoying. But I mean, I guess. But then where does this one go? Because this is blue, right? And this has to lead to somewhere else. And this is pink. So I can't lead from this to this because I'm so confused. <laughs> you know what? I give up. I give up. I can't. I can't do it. I don't know how to do this. I am so confused. Because, all right, these two are taking this in. Then this is the out. So this has to go somewhere else, which goes into, into the baggage depot. And then it has to have an exit. So do I have to connect this part to another hub? What? <laughs> That's kind of, well, how does that, what? So I can use two baggage depot per baggage hub and then each baggage depot, because I have to connect another baggage hub to it, can lead to two carousels, assuming we you know what what size, what size I get. That's kind of, you know, let's just try that out. Let's try that out. See, it, it might work. Also, while they're building that, I should probably build um the hanger for this. So let's go ahead and go with a large hanger. Nope, let's not go with a large hanger. Let's go with a small hanger. And we're going to place it right here. There we go. And we'll also hire one of those baggage thingies. All right, let's see how that's going down there. So is it working? It might be working. No idea if it's working. We'll see in a second once uh, the, the baggage thingy finishes being built. Um, I don't know if I'm doing this right. I, I hope I'm doing it right because if not, that was a huge waste of money. I don't know how much money I spent on just buying conveyor belts. Uh, assign vehicles. 
add and baggage car. There we go. Is it working? Let's go ahead and see what, what it looks like down here. All right, so, uh, nothing's happening. <laughs> All right, so, spent, I don't know how long, I think it spent like almost half an hour trying to do that and it doesn't even work. So, I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with this, but um, it looks really cool. Hopefully, I'll be able to get this working soon. Cause I, oh, it is working. Oh, look at that. It is working. All right, never mind. So, I guess I am right. You have to use a bunch of hubs. Hmm. I don't know. I find that really annoying. But I guess I'll get used to it, and I'll make something cool out of it, I guess. I'll, I'll try to make something cool out of it. It's, it's probably not going to be cool. But, like I said, I'll, I'll try and make it work. I'll try and make it work, and uh, hopefully I'll... I'll eventually get used to using baggage hubs for everything. So, anyway, I'm going to end the video off here. Let me know if you want to see more of this game. But, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe for more Sim Airport videos. And I'll be seeing you guys soon.